Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to create your own blog post graphics easily and for free using my favorite graphic design tool, Canva. If you're new here, my name is Louise of solopreneursidekick.com and I put out new tech tutorials every Tuesday and Thursday to help you grow your online business. Canva is one of my favorite tools because it allows non-designers to create gorgeous professional looking graphics in a matter of minutes. So I'm really excited to share this with you. So all you need to do is go to canva.com and then you're going to sign up for a free account. Once you're logged in, you'll see that there's all these different design templates that you can use. I would recommend using the Pinterest graphic for your blog posts. And that's because we want as many shares to Pinterest as possible. So on the left, you'll see all these different designs that you can choose from. I always say pick the actual design elements that you like rather than you know choosing a font that you like. So more looking at, like on this one, looking at the boxes and the way the items are positioned in the design. So let's just go with this one. So I'm just going to click on it and it's going to bring it over on the right. And now I can customize everything about this and super easily. So for example, if I just click on this text, I can replace it with my own. Okay, and I would put the title of my blog post here. Okay. okay, great. So now you can change the font. So if you go up here, you'll see a drop down and all these different font options. I'm going to use this one. Awesome. Okay, and then you can change the colors of everything. So I'm going to click on this black box here and you'll see these color swatches appear. Just click on that and change the color. Okay, and same with the font, you'll see a color swatch right here. Okay, great. So a few that you might need to know, across the top you have your font, the size, the color, whether you want it bold or italic, the alignment, uh, this is for uppercase, this is your bullets, this is your spacing, so you can change the spacing in between your letters. And if you need, you can copy elements on the page. So as you can see, it's just making graphic design incredibly easy. And the other one you might need to know is this arrange. So that is how you're going to determine which element is on top of the other. Okay, so then you can actually upload your own photos. So if you go over to Uploads, click Upload Your Own Images, and add that in. I've already added in one of my images, so I'm just going to click on it, drag it on top of this image. Awesome. Then I'm going to click Crop, and here I can move my image around, make it bigger. Okay, great. And as you can see, there's a filter on it already. So just click filter and you can change that to normal if you don't want that. Okay, awesome. Then you'll see there's a few other options on the left. If you go into elements, you'll see that there's a lot of different elements that you can use. Um, a common one that you might use is shapes. And then there's also a million free photos that you can use. Let's say I wanted a photo of a laptop. I would just type that in here. And then if I click on photos, it will bring up all these free images that I can use. And if you click on all, you'll see that there's a mix. So this is going to be graphics, illustrations, and photos that you can use. So those are the elements that I think you will use the most. But as you can see, it's incredibly easy to create your own graphics and you can move around all of the elements on the page. But I recommend keeping it simple and just choosing that base template that you like um, and then following that design structure. That's easiest for people that don't have professional design experience. So just choosing a layout that you like already 
and then customizing the colors and fonts. That's it for this video. I hope that it's really helped you out. Make sure that you hit subscribe, and if you liked it, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys soon with another video.